So this question starts off by saying that f of x is equal to 1.84 to the x over 4 power. The question goes on to say the function f is defined by the given equation, right? The given equation here. The equation can be rewritten as f of x equals 1 plus p over 100 to the x power, where p is a constant. Which of the following is closest to the value of p? All right, I think that we're going to use, we're going to use plug-in answer strategy. And we're going to use a little bit of translation here as well, right? We know that this function and this function should be equivalent to each other, right? Because we're just saying that it was rewritten. We're not changing anything about it. We're just rewriting it in a different form. So I'm going to write down what that means. That would mean that 1.84 to the x over 4 power is equal to, it's equivalent to, 1 plus p over 100 to the x power. So that's the first thing. The second thing is we're trying to solve for p. All these answers represent p values, which means I can use plug-in answers. So um, with choice A, when p is equal to 16, that means we'd have 1.84 to the x over fourth power equals one plus 16 over 100 to the x power. So I'm also gonna use another strategy here, uh, plug in your own number, right? So I'm kind of stacking these strategies. So I'm gonna just say, well, what about when x is one? Let's just make this easy. If I make x zero, that makes it too difficult because anything to the zero power is one. But by making x equal one, or no, no, let's actually make x equal four to deal with this x over four power for 1.84. By, by making x equals four, I can really test out each of these options, right? So when x is four, I'd have 1.84 to the first power because again, when x is four, four over four is one. And we're saying that that should be equal to, what's 16 over 100? 16 divided by 100 is 0.16. So one plus 0.16 is 1.16. Then I have 1.16 to the fourth power, because x is 4. And this is what I want to test out. Is it true that 1.84 to the first power, which is just 1.84, is equal to 1.16 to the fourth power? Let me go to my calculator and check that out. So 1.16 to the fourth. I get that that's equal to 1.81. Now, the question does say which of these is closest to the value of p. So this is fairly close, right? 1.84 and 1.81 are very close to each other. So I kind of like choice A as an answer, but I can, I'll try choice B and just see what's happening with it. So choice B, again, I'm still gonna say x equals four. So choice B will still get me this 1.84 value, but it'll be 1.84 is equal to um, one plus 21 over 100 to the fourth power which again, 21 divided by 100 is 0.21. One plus 0.21 would be 1.21. So 1.21 to the fourth power, I can check that in my calculator, 1.21 to the fourth power. Well, that gets me 2.14, right? So that's, that's not as close at all, right? So I don't like choice B. Choice A is much better than choice B. And my assumption is that as I get even larger numbers in there, my values will get even further away from choice A. And that's why I think that choice A is the best answer. You can definitely try out choice C and choice D here, but choice A, right, this is still, this is very close. We're not gonna get closer than this by increasing our P values here. So choice A is the best answer here.